God is waiting on just a few more individuals um, that he has chosen to represent him in, in his kingdom, in the kingdom of God, to pack their bags. I heard that clearly in my spirit. Um, he's waiting on a few more persons. He has selected those individuals, but those persons, um, they are wavering. They are not living their best life in God. They have not come to that secret place that God has called them to be in. That place where God will change them from the inside out. That place where God will supernaturally come through for them. That place where God will, will turn their, their shame into, into joy and their, their sadness into, into everlasting happiness. Um, that place where they will feel worthy, that place where they, they, their faith is being built. They have not come to that place. God has called them into that secret place, but they have refused um, to, to live in that place with God, that position in God. And God is waiting on those individuals to to, to deny themselves of themselves, to take up their cross and to follow after God. God has work for you guys. Um, God has work for you to do in the last of the last days. He has great plans for you. Supernatural plan that God has for you. But you are standing in the way of your own purpose. His purposes must be fulfilled, but you are standing in the way of your own purpose. You are standing in the way of your own deliverance. And God is saying to you today, deny yourself, pick up yourself, pick up your cross and give up your idols. You're not willing to, to, to give up the things and the places that you think are the best things for you. God has bigger things in store for you. He has bigger places to take you. He has bigger things to give you guys. So he's saying to you today, pack up your bags, pack it up. Pack up your folly grounds, pack up your dirty ways, pack up your dirty ways of living. He has purpose for you. He has a destiny for you to go to. He has, he has somewhere, he has plans for you, has things for you to do. So guys, you know yourself, you know who you are, you know, you know that you have been in disobedience. You know that you have been denying and wavering. You know, you know yourselves. So God is waiting on you. God is waiting on you. You are the ones holding up the boat. <laughs> God has plans for you. You are the ones who are holding up the boat. He wants to row the boat, guys. He wants to row the boat. But you are holding up his plans.